Hi, I'm Paul from Telecoms Cloud, and this is another in our series of video how-to guides using the Telecoms Cloud API. In this episode, we're going to be talking about the E.164 format for international phone numbers and how you can use the Telecoms Cloud API to work with this format and take a telephone number in normal national format and turn it into an E.164 formatted number and vice versa. Now, if you're new to the Telecoms Cloud API and you haven't already set up your environment to work with our PHP client available on GitHub, click the link that's appearing here now to watch the episode on how to get started and then come back to this video once you're all set up. So the E.164 format, that's the standardized format for displaying international phone numbers, usually prefixed with a plus sign which tells the caller to use the appropriate international call prefix for the country from which they're dialing. The Telecoms Cloud API provides two easy to use methods for working with E.164 and national phone numbers and I'm going to be exploring those two methods in this quick video. So the first thing I'm going to do is go to my sandbox that I have set up and my demo page here and very simply I'm going to create a variable called formatted number using the client which I've defined there and I'm going to use the format number E164 function and then I'm going to pass to that inside square brackets first of all the number that I want to format I'm just going to make up a pretend number Let's go 0207 9464981 and I'm going to tell the Telecoms Cloud API the location of that number which is GB and that's it so then I'm going to use var dump to see the result from that API call save that and refresh here and you'll see that's returned the phone number in E.164 format, so it's put plus 44 at the start there. The flip side to that is to take a number which is already in E.164 format and format that as a national number. So to do that, I'm just going to return to my text editor here and I will again define a new variable, client, and this time I'm going to use format number national and pass that in square brackets first of all the the number and this time I'm going to pass the number in E.164 format so I'll take that copy that and paste that in there and again I'm going to pass the location as GB and then once again, I shall var dump that out. Refresh that. And you'll see it's taken the E.164 formatted number and returned it back in national format. So there we are. It's a very quick guide on working with E.164 formatted numbers and national numbers using the Telecoms Cloud API. For more how-to guides and documentation, you can visit telecomscloud.com forward slash API. You can follow us and get in contact on Twitter. We're at Telecoms API. And of course, check out our YouTube channel for more how-to videos. That's youtube.com slash telecomscloud. I've been Paul Freeman Powell. Thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you next time.